Welcome to Pins and Things! Today, we're going to be making do-it-yourself glitter shoes! I've tried it on flat casual shoes that are made of canvas and the other one is a synthetic high heel. What you're going to need is some shoes. You don't have to have them brand new. They can just be some old high heels or whatever kind of shoes. Really, you can do this to any type of shoe. We also have whatever color of glitter that you want. I'm gonna be using red because I think that these would make adorable Valentine's Day shoes. You can also use them for cosplaying, Wizard of Oz, costume, anything like that. One of these little foam brushes or a paintbrush would work too. Spray adhesive and some Mod Podge. And I just have about that much on a plate. I have a paper here that I'm gonna be using to kind of keep the mess under control a little bit. It's gonna be messy, it's glitter, but who doesn't love glitter, right? So I have my red glitter. I'm gonna put about that much glitter on and I'm gonna start mixing it together. This is gonna be for our first layer of glitter. One shoe at a time. Just want to make sure every part of the outside where I want the glitter to be is sticky and covered in glue. All right, here comes the messy part. I'm just taking the glitter now and I'm actually patting it down onto the shoe. After I paint the whole shoe with this, then I'm gonna use the spray adhesive, and then I'm gonna do another layer with Mod Podge. I think padding works a lot better than like rubbing it on, you know? Looking good. I'm just adding a little bit of glue in the spots that are a little bit more bare and where the glue has dried a little bit already so that I can just cover that in the glitter. <sighs> That's looking like a mighty fine, I'd say. <laughs> All of a sudden, I just got this burst of excitement. I've always wanted little red glitter shoes on the Wizard of Oz. I mean, who, as a child, did not dream about having Wizard of Oz shoes? Am I right? Okay, I'm just still working on filling in the little spots that need a little bit more glitter by adding a little bit more Mod Podge and tapping it down. So the shoes were sitting here for 20 minutes drying the Mod Podge, and after that, I went out, I sprayed them with the spray adhesive, and now while it's still tacky, I'm just putting on some more glitter to kind of cover up the rest of the spots here. And it's starting to look really good. So to finish these shoes and make it so that the glitter doesn't come off or stick on anybody or anything or stick to every hair in the house, <laughs> I actually took the sealant spray and I sprayed the whole thing. It was still sticky and what I ended up doing was just putting one last layer of Mod Podge over the top of the whole shoe. It sealed it up very nicely and now none of the glitter is coming off. Like I can rub it and stuff and I don't have any glitter coming off on me. They look so cute. They turned out so amazing. And then I also wanted to show you taking off the tape because it's satisfying. <laughs> <laughs> but it's just so nice. Take a look at this. So I put the tape over the parts where I didn't want it to get onto. It looks so good. And I like it because I didn't have to accidentally get glitter in the wrong place and then try and get rid of it later. Especially back here, I really needed the tape because up here you can kind of see there's like a ridge that the shoe was sewn on. But back here, there was just a little stitching. There wasn't really a ridge or anything. So I just followed the stitching with the tape and it really helped to guide me where the glitter needed to be. They're so cute. They turned out so cute. So I hope you guys loved this video. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. I have tons of other costumes that I do like all the time. These would be great for like a Wizard of Oz cosplay, Valentine's Day, a hot date night. <laughs> you can also follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. If you would like, you can watch another Valentine's video over here, or you can watch The Beach House, which is my daily video channel that I put up videos every single day of my adorable family. They're adorable, I love them. Okay, we'll see you guys next time.